finding a good location that is compliant but also meets all the fire safety regulations it can be a bit tricky um, if you don't have a very basic you know set house with a big garage and i guess we talk about that that's the elephant in the room is that the reason for all of these standards that we're um, dealing with is about fire safety as5139 is the standard that tells us where we can and can't put batteries and all the other requirements around batteries realistically it's it's very similar technology to what's in the electric cars it's a well-known fact that electric cars are significantly less likely to catch a light than a ice or an internal combustion engine car. There's a big difference between a quality you know, BYD or Tesla battery and a cheap scooter from China. One thing that has caught us out before, and this is something that where there's a bit of obscurity in the regulations, is glass. Glass is predominantly not classified to this fire safety standard. If you're coming into windows here, if there's a window in the way. Correct. Yep. So a lot of the regulations basically talk about it being away from openable windows. But even if a window is openable into a habitable room, that window is no longer a fireproof material. Then we run into an issue of, okay, well now are we breaching that fire standard? Yeah, exactly. And um, I can't remember what the standard is called, but there is a standard that explains what is a fire resistant material and glass isn't one of them unless it is particularly designed to be in a in a fire zone or something like that. You know, if you've, if you've spent a bucket load of money, you'll probably know that you've got a fireproof rated window, but otherwise you probably don't. Previously, we've thought, because the way the standard says that if there's a window and that part of the window isn't openable, you know, you've got your sliding window, that part isn't open within your exclusion zone then we're completely fine and because it's only the openable window but in fact that window if it is within our exclusion zone which we haven't even covered yet yeah. it's up on the screen there any kind of window in that zone that will just shatter and melt in the case of a fire yeah. so we can't have it there the likelihood of combustion is is so low especially with a quality battery but this is a fairly new technology, fairly new installation, and I, I think it's really there's a there's probably an overabundance of caution at this stage. I think as statistics come out in terms of what the real safety is, then some of these rules may be relaxed.